here with Matt Brown, the, the cartoonist for all the Building 19 circulars that you throw away every week <laughs> or every month whenever you get them. And he has a short story to tell us about Don't Give Up the Ship. Right. Go ahead, Matt. Well, on June 1st, 1813, the USS uh, Chesapeake was bottled up in Boston Harbor, blockaded by the HMS Shannon, which lurked outside of Boston Harbor. Now, the Shannon was a, an experienced frigate that was... Oh, I don't, I don't mean to interrupt you, but this is going to go on my YouTube site, so don't swear. Don't be saying frigate or any well, of that stuff. Well, that's what it's okay. called. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it was just like the, uh, the, the uh, Chesapeake was a sister ship to the frigate Constitution. Oh, I just told you not to say It's that. called a frigate. <laughs> okay. That's the name of the ship. Okay. God damn it, aren't you listening? <laughs> well, you're going to say frigate too? <laughs> I know. Well, anyway, so that we have two ships. One blockaded in Boston Harbor, another one lurking outside. Well, on June 1st, 1813, the newly commissioned captain of the USS Chesapeake decided he had to come out, even though he had a green crew and he, he himself had only just been commissioned captain. So out he went. He sailed six leagues due east of Boston Harbor, passing Boston Light, and there he met the Shannon, and it was all over very quickly because the Shannon was an experience. Is that the Shannon there? That's a, no, that's the Schaefer. That's a shark. <laughs> okay. Because the Shannon was an experienced frigate. And, <laughs> and <laughs> Caitlin, I'm sorry you keep saying frigate. <laughs> and uh, it was a terrible battle. Uh, within five minutes, 61 Americans lie dead. The new newly commissioned captain, Joseph Lawrence, was uh, mortally wounded. And his last words were, tell the men to fire faster and don't give up the ship. Fight her till she sinks. Well, that didn't help very much. The British won. They took over the Chesapeake, one-third of the U.S. Navy, and sailed it to Halifax, Nova Scotia. It was a bad day for the, for the United States forces in the War of 1812. But three months later, September 1st, 1813, on Lake Erie, the, com, uh, Commodore Oliver Hazard Perry, a good friend of Lawrence's, recommissioned his ship, the USS Lawrence, and he put a big flag up on the rear end of his ship that read, Don't give up the ship. And he attacked the British, and this time the Americans won. And they drove the American, they drove, drove the British from Lake Erie and made it possible for the War of 1812 to be ended in a draw, which is what they wanted. And uh, the interesting part of this whole story is the Shannon versus Chesapeake took place 12 miles from Situate. It could have been seen from the top of uh, Second Cliff. It probably could have been seen uh, from the, the shore, at least the tops of the, of the uh, sails. Awesome. It, and nobody to this day has said much about it. So on the 350... We're going to co commemorate that? We're going to commemorate that with T-shirts and a reception. And the reception is going to have the captain think on. I, think I'll be able to go to the reception? Well, yeah. If you depends what kind of a deal we make with these T-shirts. Oh, what the fuck? Then we're not. Right after, I mean, right uh, what did that? So, what did you say, frigate? <laughs> 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 Thank That's you, Matt. I appreciate it. Well,